You've seen the ads, bright white smiles, toothpaste that promises Hollywood teeth. But here's the question. Can whitening toothpaste actually whiten your teeth? Or is it just clever marketing? In this video, I'll reveal what whitening toothpaste really does, why some people see results and others don't, and the truth about its limits. Stay with me until the end. Because I'll share what whitening toothpaste can never do, no matter how much you use it. Whitening toothpaste is one of the most popular dental products in the world. Millions use it daily, hoping for a brighter smile. But here's the first twist. Whitening toothpaste does not bleach your teeth. Unlike professional whitening, it doesn't change the internal color of enamel. So, what does it actually do? Most whitening toothpastes work in two ways. Number one, mild abrasives. These gently polish away surface stains from coffee, tea, red wine, and smoking. Number two, chemical agents. Low levels of peroxide can lighten surface stains a little. The result? They can make teeth look slightly brighter by removing stains on the outside. But here's the catch. They don't reach the deeper discoloration inside your teeth. And that's where most stains really come from. So, can whitening toothpaste make your teeth whiter? Yes but only to a point. If your stains are surface level, you may see results in a few weeks. But if your teeth are naturally darker or discolored from aging or medication, toothpaste alone won't fix it. It can brighten, but it can't transform. And that's why many people feel disappointed. Here's something ads don't tell you. Using whitening toothpaste too much can cause problems. Because of the abrasives, some brands can wear down enamel over time, not overnight, but with years of daily use. This can make teeth more sensitive, and once enamel is gone, it never grows back. That's why dentists recommend cycling whitening toothpaste, or alternating with a regular fluoride toothpaste. I'll explain the safest way to use it in a moment. Whitening toothpaste works best when stains are mild and surface level. You avoid stain-causing drinks like coffee and wine. You use it consistently for two to six weeks. But here's the truth. It only maintains brightness. Think of it as a maintenance tool, not a miracle cure. If you want dramatic results, you'll need something stronger. And that means professional whitening. Professional treatments, in-office or take-home kits, use much stronger bleaching agents. They penetrate enamel and change the internal color of teeth. That's why they deliver dramatic results quickly. Toothpaste, by comparison, only works on the surface. So if you're expecting a toothpaste to give you a Hollywood smile, it's not going to happen. But whitening toothpaste does have a real role. And I'll explain that now. Here's the truth. Whitening toothpaste isn't designed to be a total whitening solution. It's designed to maintain. If you've had professional whitening, whitening toothpaste helps prevent stains from returning. If you're a coffee or tea drinker, it slows down new discoloration. So it's less about making your teeth white and more about keeping them from getting darker. So can whitening toothpaste actually whiten your teeth? Yes, but only for surface stains. It can brighten, polish, and maintain, but it can't change your natural shade and it can't fix deep stains. For real whitening, you'll need professional treatment. But for everyday maintenance, whitening toothpaste can definitely help. If you found this helpful, Subscribe for more science-based dental care tips.